before we start this video, can we just appreciate how beautiful these cupcakes are and how excited I am to eat them? What's up guys? It's Tia. Welcome back to my channel. Uh, today's video is going to be a haul video. Um, I went shopping all day today. And so I thought it'd be fun to share with you guys the stuff that I got today because I got a lot of fun things. Um, let's see, I have some stuff from Victoria's Secret, some stuff from TJ Maxx, I went to Target and Barnes and Noble. Yeah, lots of fun stuff. So let's just jump right in. Uh, so first we'll just start with this because I only got one thing from there. But I went to Ross and I just got these little like Spanx workout shorts, whatever. Um, I'm getting a gym membership next week, and so I decided that I probably need some gym clothes. Uh, next, what should we look at? We'll go to TJ Maxx next in the same department. Uh, so the first thing that I got is this little, what is this called? Style station. Uh, basically, it's just like a thing, and you can set it on your counter, and you can hang it on like your bar in your bathroom and you can put like your blow dryer and your straightener and curling iron and stuff in here. So I got this in hopes of trying to free up some space and get a little bit more organized. I also got a couple other things from TJ Maxx. Um, I got these tweezers. They're just like a normal tweezer and then these ones are skinnier at the top so that they can grab more precise hairs or whatever. And to go along with that, I got this mirror. You can see my ghetto setup if I show it to you. And then this side magnifies everything so that I can tweeze my eyebrows really well. And I needed a new brush, so I got a new brush. Um, and I got this wet and dry one to see if it'll help with my hair not falling out because I brush my hair when it's wet. And a lot of the times it like pulls my hair out and I lose a lot of hair. And this is supposed to prevent that, so I got that. Hopefully it works. And then I also just got some socks. They're like the Converse ones that are low cut right here so that they don't show when you wear Converse. And the last thing I got was just this t-shirt that I saw. I was drawn to it because it was tie-dye and then when I grabbed it, it says sup on the front. So I was like, that's like a quirky little t-shirt. And I found it in the men's section too. So yeah, that's what I got from TJ Maxx. Moving right along, um, I'll show you what I got from Victoria's Secret. I only got two things from Victoria's Secret uh, because they're so freaking expensive I can never buy a ton of stuff from there. But the first thing that I got is just this little bralette. Um, it's just a halter top one and it's coral and it's lacy. And then I got these sweatpants. They're just gray and right there they say pink. And then the waistband's like the weird like elasticy waistband. They were on sale and they only cost me 25 bucks, so that's why I bought them. Next, I'm gonna show you what I got at Target because I spent $100 at Target, so I got quite a few things. So the first thing that I got, I don't know if this is weird if I show this to you, but I'm gonna show it to you anyways. But they're exactly the same and they're just bras. And they're ones that like clip in the front and have like the racer back, so you can wear them with strappy tank tops. Um, and then the next thing that I got were these two tank tops. They're exactly the same, but I got two different colors. And it's the Mosimo, I don't know how to say it, brand. But it's like the racer back tank top, and then it's just like flowy on the bottom. So I got this one that's like maroon and white striped. And then I got the black one, just like it, which is why I got the coral bralette. Uh, cause I think it'll look really cute underneath it here. Also at Target, I got some Peeps Oreos because I love Peeps. I'm obsessed with them and they had, I didn't know they had an Oreo flavor that was Peeps flavored. So I bought them to try them and they were pretty good, but they're sugary as fuck. Then I got this DVD. It's just the Vampire Academy. Um, I bought it because it was on sale for $5 and that is the only reason why. The next thing that I got was some makeup. Um, I got this. It's the Maybelline Better Skin, uh, Super Stay Better Skin, Skin Transforming Powder. Um, and I've already used it, but, uh, it's just a powder and it has a little mirror. Um, but I got this in an influencer box a while back and I tried it and I fell in love with it 
and mine just ran out this morning so I bought some more of it uh, but it's basically just a powder um, but it has salicylic acid in it so it's supposed to help with your acne and I also got the elf acne fighting foundation um, I tried this a while back and I really loved it it's a super light fine foundation but it's like got pretty decent coverage and it lasts and it doesn't make my skin oily because I have really oily skin so some foundations make it look more oily than it is um, and it's acne fighting again so that's always good the last thing that I got is soap and glory sexy mother pucker lip plumping gloss um, I have one of these it's just a clear gloss and I absolutely love it so I got this one because it has like shimmers in it it's in the shade spun sugar so it's just like a light pink shimmering gloss the last thing that I got is this bath bomb um, by the bomb bath fizzers I've never heard of this before but I just saw this and I bought it because it looks like the earth um, and it says that it's a sea breeze bath fizzer with a surprise inside so that also got me thinking like what is the surprise so I bought it because it looks like the earth and I want to see what the surprise is inside because I'm five years old and it's like finding a toy in your cereal box for people who love surprises which is me so I bought it um, I'll show you what I got from Barnes & Noble I got some records from Barnes & Noble and I am super excited about them so the first one that I got is Justin Bieber's Believe um, I just really love Justin Bieber that's all that's really the only reason I bought this and it was only $20 I'm pretty sure all of these are just on black pressings and I haven't opened them yet so we're not gonna attempt that and then the next one that I got this one was also only $20 uh, Bruno Mars is 24 karat magic um, or is it 24 K or 24 karat mm, I don't know but anyways I bought it um, I really love this album I've been listening to it a lot lately and that's what I like it has been my 100% jam I've been listening to it like 500 times a day so I decided to buy this especially because it was only $20 so it was a good deal and then I bought one more and this one's really fun and I was really excited about it because it was only 20 it was only $25 and there's two discs in it and it has a ton of songs on here but it is the Guardians of the Galaxy Deluxe uh, vinyl edition soundtrack it has two discs the first disc is like the awesome mix volume one which is like all of the 80s songs and the songs that they played on there and then the second disc is a disc of all the scores from the movie. So that's fun too. Like if you're ever just studying and you want to just turn them on. But yeah, and it was only $25. So it was pretty cheap. Um, and then I have one more place that I went to. Um, and I spent $100 in there too. Uh, but I went to Journeys. But the first thing, I bought this. They, the guys, the two guys at the store talked me into buying this. So I'm hoping that it works. Um, but it's this, I don't know how to say that, Crep Protect, uh, but it's like this weird spray and you're supposed to spray it on your shoes and it's supposed to be rain and stain resistant so like it's not supposed to, like if they get wet it's not supposed to leave a watermark and it's not supposed to stain, it's supposed to make them like just like drip off of there. So I bought it because I might as well try it, I buy so many shoes um, so I might as well try it out. Um, and then I got two pairs of shoes. One of them, both of them are Converse. Uh, one of them is a pair that I went in there specifically to buy. And then the other one is a pair that the guy at the store talked me into buying because they were on sale. Uh, but I just got the black and white high top chucks. I am a sucker for Converse, especially high top Converse. I got those and that's what I went in the store to buy. And then when I was checking out the guy brought these out and he's been trying to sell them because there's like a scuff on one of the sides and so he either has to like return them to the company or sell them and it was like this weird big thing but he was like you might like these and since there's a scuff on them they're half off so instead of costing sixty dollars they only cost me thirty dollars and they are these cool high top ish all gray converse and I really loved them 
so I decided to buy them. I'm going to show you. So this little teeny, do you see that little teeny tiny scuff right there? That's why he couldn't sell these for full price. And I was like, you can barely even see that. I'm not even worried about it. They were only $30. So I bought them because I have no self-control. But yeah, that was uh, not, an, not as epic of a haul as I thought it was going to be. Um, I thought I bought a lot more stuff than that, but I guess I didn't. So I guess that's going to be the end of this video because I have nothing else to show you guys. But uh, I'm really excited about all this new stuff I got. I'm really excited to wear my new shoes. If you want to stick around to see what other kinds of videos I decide to make, um, like haul videos or music videos or vinyl videos or whatever it is, you can go ahead and hit subscribe and I would appreciate it. But until then, I'll see you guys next time.